Rameswaram is situated on Pamban Island. It is connected to mainland India by the iconic Pamban Bridge. It is located in the Gulf of Manar, which is a part of the larger Indian Ocean. Rameswaram is positioned in the Ramanathapuram district of Tamil Nadu, the southernmost state of India. The island is approximately 50 kilometers long and is surrounded by the Bay of Bengal on one side and the Palk Strait on the other. Historical Importance Rameswaram holds immense historical and mythological significance in India. According to Hindu mythology, Rameswaram is believed to be the place where Lord Rama, the seventh avatar of Lord Vishnu, built a bridge, referred to as Ram Setu or Adam's Bridge, across the sea to reach Lanka, Sri Lanka, and rescue his wife Sita from the demon King Ravana. Ramanathaswami Temple the Ramanathaswami Temple is the most prominent and revered religious site in Rameswaram. It is dedicated to Lord Shiva and is considered one of the twelve Jyotirlinga temples in India. The temple boasts a magnificent architectural style and is renowned for its intricate carvings. The longest temple corridor in the world, measuring about 1.2 kilometers, is also located within the Ramanathaswami temple complex. Pilgrims from all over the country visit the temple to seek blessings and perform sacred rituals. The Pamban Bridge The Pamban Bridge, also known as the Pamban Rail Bridge, is a significant landmark in Rameswaram. It was constructed in 1914 and was the first sea bridge in India. The bridge connects Rameswaram to the mainland and is an engineering marvel. It is a double-leaf bascule bridge, meaning it can be raised to allow the passage of ships and vessels. The bridge offers breathtaking views of the ocean and the surrounding islands, making it a popular attraction among tourists. Danush Kodi Danush Kodi is an abandoned town located at the eastern tip of Rameswaram. It holds historical and mythological importance, as it is believed to be the place where Lord Rama broke the bridge after his victorious return from Lanka. In 1964, Danush Kodi was devastated by a cyclone that submerged the town and left it uninhabited. Today, the ruins of Danush Kodi serve as a reminder of its tragic past, and visitors can witness the remnants of the old railway station, church, and other structures. Rameswaram Beaches Rameswaram is renowned for its picturesque beaches that offer tranquility and natural beauty. Agnithirtham is the most popular beach and is considered sacred by Hindus. It is believed that taking a dip in the holy waters of Agnithirtham washes away one's sins. Danush Kodi Beach, on the other hand, provides a serene and secluded atmosphere with its white sand and clear blue waters. Ariyaman Beach is known for its clean shores and is a favorite spot for leisure activities and picnics. The mythological story behind Rameswaram is closely associated with the epic Hindu scripture called the Ramayana. According to the Ramayana, Rameswaram holds great significance in the journey of Lord Rama, the seventh avatar of Lord Vishnu. The story begins with Lord Rama's wife, Sita, being abducted by the demon King Ravana and taken to his kingdom in Lanka, modern-day Sri Lanka. Lord Rama, along with his loyal brother Lakshmana and the monkey army led by Hanuman, embarked on a quest to rescue Sita and defeat Ravana. As Lord Rama and his army reached the southern coast of India, they faced a dilemma, how to cross the vast expanse of the ocean and reach Lanka. At this point, Lord Rama sought the guidance of Lord Shiva, the presiding deity of Rameswaram. Lord Rama performed an elaborate penance, tapasya, and prayed to Lord Shiva for his blessings and assistance in building a bridge to Lanka. Pleased with Lord Rama's devotion, Lord Shiva appeared before him and granted him the boon of a bridge. With Lord Shiva's blessings, Lord Rama and his army constructed a bridge made of floating stones and trees across the sea, which is famously known as Ram Setu or Adam's Bridge.
Once the bridge was built, Lord Rama and his army crossed over to Lanka, engaged in a fierce battle with Ravana, and eventually emerged victorious, rescuing Sita. To commemorate this divine event, Lord Rama installed a lingam, symbolic representation of Lord Shiva, and performed rituals to seek forgiveness for any sins committed during the war. This lingam is believed to be the Ramanathaswami lingam, the presiding deity of the Ramanathaswami temple in Ramaswaram. Since then, Ramaswaram has become a revered pilgrimage site for Hindus. It is believed that a visit to Ramaswaram and the worship of Lord Ramanathaswami Lingam can absolve one of their sins and bring salvation, moksha. Ocean Views The Pamban Bridge provides stunning views of the vast expanse of the ocean. As you stand on the bridge, you can witness the azure waters of the Bay of Bengal on one side and the Indian Ocean on the other. The panoramic views extend as far as the eye can see, offering a mesmerizing sight of the merging waters and the horizon beyond. Marine Life The waters surrounding the Pamban Bridge are rich in marine life, making it an area of ecological importance. The sight of these fascinating creatures adds to the enchanting experience of being on the bridge. Island Scenery Pombon Island, where the bridge is situated, is a scenic location with pristine beaches, lush greenery, and quaint villages. The island's natural beauty can be seen from the bridge, providing a captivating backdrop as you traverse across it. The sight of palm trees, coastal vegetation, and small settlements on the island enhances the overall charm of the surroundings. Surrounding Islands From the Pombon Bridge, you can also catch glimpses of several small islands scattered in the vicinity. Some of these islands include Adams Island, which is where the Ram Setu or Adams Bridge is believed to be located, and Mantai Island. Visiting the Pombon Bridge allows you to immerse yourself in the stunning coastal scenery, embrace the tranquility of the ocean, and witness the natural wonders that surround it. It is an experience that combines the grandeur of engineering with the awe-inspiring beauty of nature. Fishing is a significant occupation in Ramaswaram due to its coastal location and abundant marine resources. Agriculture especially the cultivation of paddy and coconut, is also practiced in the surrounding areas. The locals also enjoy traditional Tamil vegetarian dishes such as doses, idlis, sambars, and rice-based preparations. Mean Kuzambu. A spicy fish curry cooked with tamarind, spices, and coconut. Crab masala. Crabs cooked in a flavorful masala gravy. Prawn Biryani. Fragrant rice preparation with succulent prawns, spices, and aromatic herbs. Local delicacies and sweets. Apart from the main dishes, Ramaswaram is also known for its unique local delicacies and sweets, such as Ramaswaram Marivali Kalangu chips, crispy tapioca chips, a popular snack in the region. Shopping in Ramaswaram. Ramaswaram offers a variety of items that tourists can purchase as souvenirs or mementos of their visit. Silk Saris Tamil Nadu is renowned for its silk saris, and Ramaswaram has several shops where you can find beautiful silk weaves.